It was a busy day on campus today at Idaho State University as students there came roaring back. Roar, Bengals, roar! And students were excited to get back on campus for the first day of classes. The university had information booths set up to make sure everyone felt welcome and knew where to go. Mask mandates are in place for all indoor spaces at ISU. Registration is still ongoing, so administration doesn't quite have enrollment numbers yet. And now that the first day of class is out of the way and in the books, the real fun begins. Local News 8's Linda Larson joins us now live from the Welcome Back Orange and Black Party going on right now in historic downtown Pocatello. Linda, it looks like it's already picking up to be quite the party. It is picking up. We are having a great time already and never being one to miss a party. Check this out. We are having so much fun. And right now I am joined by Idaho State University student body president Zane Webb. And Zane, uh, tell us what this event means to the community and especially to the students. Yeah, so this event is just meant to bring the community and Idaho State Bengals together. We have a lot of sponsors here and donors that have contributed a ton. As I'm sure you're aware, ICCU has gone and brought a ton of involvement back to Idaho State through uh, their new building that they've done. And there's just so much going on. I know personally, I'm excited to have everyone be back in person, be able to meet Bengals face to face outside. So like I said, it's just an exciting time. It is, and right now, you can hear if we turn over this way, let's take a look at this. We have the band coming in. We have all kinds of fun going on. We're gonna just let you take a listen and enjoy all the 